Hi. This is the first time I've ever done anything like this. But I have frontal sinus disease. That is disease in the frontal sinuses in the forehead area. I also have sinus disease everywhere else, but that's a little more under control. So in two days, I am having my seventh sinus surgery. And I was just wondering if there's any other people out there like me who've had uh, the uh, luck that I've had, or I wouldn't call it luck, actually. The uh, surgery has failed uh, mainly in the left frontal sinus. It keeps uh, shutting down. Uh, closing up and then there's no drainage whatsoever. Uh, it, you know, infection festers in there. Um, it creates a tremendous amount of pain and pressure. It's absolutely debilitating at times, the pain and the headaches. Um, so, lucky me is getting a frontal sinus trepanation on Monday at 8 o'clock in the morning. They're going to go in endosco endoscopically to begin with, like they always do. And they're going to go in and uh, go up and reopen the left frontal sinus, open it up, clean it all out. Uh, then they're also going to do a bilateral spin, what is it called? The sphenoid sinuses. They're in kind of behind the frontal sinuses. They're also totally opacified. So they're going to go in there and um, clean those out. Then they're going to do a frontal sinus trepanation, which I can't seem to find anybody who's had this done because it's not very common. And I'm not looking forward to it, but I'm praying it's going to help. So I thought I'd put it up here in case anybody was interested or had this experience. Basically, they are going to cut into my forehead or my sort of over this way. God, I mixed up on this thing. Anyways, and put an incision in. They're going to drill through my skull into the frontal sinus. And then they are going to put some sort of a tube in there that's going to be sticking out of my head. So I'll show everybody how lovely that looks when, when that's done. And then a nurse will be coming in every day to put the medicine, the prednisone and the antibiotics and whatever else they want to put in there uh, directly into this tube, whoops, in my head. Oh wait, this is the left side, I'll be okay. Right here, that's where they're gonna cut me open. And put the medicine right in there and it'll go right into the left frontal sinus to hopefully settle it down. I have to have this tube in there for two months, people. Two months, oh my goodness. Um, that ought to be interesting, okay? So I'm praying that this is going to work. Um, I have been totally debilitated. The last surgery was six months ago. I had a FEST procedure and the left frontal sinus closed up. It was closing up when the stents were still in there. Uh, January 2010, I had a draft, um, a draft, what, oh God, I can't even think right now. Draft blah, blah, three. Anyways, basically they took out the bottom part of the frontal sinuses. They did all this endoscopically and they took out a bunch of bone and they made a, whoops, sorry, a big area here that opens up. Um, but it didn't work. So, off uh, I go again. Anyways, um, I'm also an asthmatic and I suffer from Samster's triad, which means I'm allergic to anti-inflammatories. Um, so I'm just, you know, I have polyps everywhere and just, uh, just one hot mess up there. Anyway, so I thought I'd let you know what I look like now and, uh, maybe I'll do a quick post tomorrow night before surgery. And then, um, I will be in the hospital for a couple of days and then going to go up. Uh, probably to my sister's to be looked after for a little while and then back into the city. But I will post as soon as I can. Anyways, I'd love to hear from anybody who has had, I've been suffering, I've had 
Well, this, uh, all the surgery started in 2006. And uh, like I said, this is my seventh surgery. And I hope my last. Please, God, may it be my last. I'd like to get my life back because it literally has taken my quality of life away, this disease, due to the uh, pain and pressure and constant infections that are stuck in there and just everything about it. It's taken me down pretty bad and uh, I don't want that. I need my life back. So um, thank you for listening and uh, I'd love to hear from some people who are going through the same nightmare sinuses from hell is what i call them and um especially the frontal and they're actually the most dangerous ones to operate on lovely uh, because of the eye and the brain and the location of them and all that stuff so i don't know if you ever get used to that but i do have a very good surgeon it's my third doctor they keep sending me on to somebody else because they can't do anything else for me so and i'm up in canada so uh Hello from Canada. All right. Thank you very much. Bye. I got to figure out how to turn it off now. Bear with me. There. Bye.